if you are new here, then welcome. I am a literally tall weightlifter who recently started talking to a camera because quarantine. Actually, it's not even a camera. It's just my phone. So clearly, I am a pro YouTuber. I am on my way to Atlas, which is my weightlifting club, because I'm gonna go pick up some mats, because today I am building a platform. This angle is not doing me any favors. Okay, I shouldn't be looking at myself. I should just be looking at the rope. So anyways, I'm gonna go pick up some mats um, to build this platform, and I'm just gonna say this right now. It's it's kind of an unnecessary platform. Like it, It's definitely more of a nice to have than a need to have. Um, I'm lifting in my parents garage right now because obviously all the gyms are closed and I think I mean for a garage it's actually pretty nice like the floor is pretty even it's not on a slope or anything um, it's a little bit uneven to the one side um, it's not the end of the world but you can definitely feel it so we might try and see if we can kind of level that out a little bit um, so yeah and so since I am living the broke ass athlete life, I am gonna try and build this for zero money. So, so that's why I'm gonna go pick up these mats that Frank luckily didn't really need. Um, he just had them kind of lying around. So I'm just gonna borrow those. I probably shouldn't actually film and drive. Um, I know that Frank is gonna yell at me when he sees this, but I promise I did set everything up before I started driving so I wasn't I wasn't fumbling around then when I was driving, so uh, don't don't be too mad, Frank, please. All right, I'm gonna go and I will see you in a little bit. So we're gonna use these little mats here and they're a little bit too tall but it's only gonna be by like I don't know a centimeter or something so it'll be fine so we're just gonna go get these in my car and then I'm gonna go again all right so we got the stuff so now I'm on my way to my parents house and it's about an hour and a half long drive so kind of a lot of driving today. Um, from my apartment to Atlas, it's about an hour drive, and then, like I just said, about an hour and a half from there to my parents' house, and then from there to go home again, it's going to be about an hour as well. So, uh, so yeah, kind of a lot of driving today. Also, I, I probably shouldn't film this like while I'm driving, because I have a feeling the audio is going to be awful, but we'll see about that. So, uh, yeah, anyways, I'm just going to drive now, and I will see you once we get to the garage. platform and these are actually crazy expensive but it just so happened that um, one of my dad's friends had these lying around so I'm, I'm so happy he would let me use these. Alright so what you want to do is start by making a base layer and normally like if you didn't if you don't know anyone who just happens to have the stuff laying around then you would just use like normal plywood and what you want to do is just like do one layer of like putting two um pieces of plywood this way and then two more like kind of on top of that and then a fancier piece of wood on top of that and then put your mats on the side of that. I don't know if this makes sense, but that's what you would normally do. But because we have these like super thick ones, we're just gonna do this uh, one bottom layer. And then we're gonna put another piece of plywood on there and then the mats. So like I said earlier, the floor is just a little bit tilted to the side. So we did put like 
right around the middle actually we did put just a little piece of wood under it to kind of level it out just a little bit and i am so excited about that all right so we're gonna go put a piece of plywood on there and then the mats onto this side not necessary but we also have this um, in our platforms in Atlas and it's gonna go under the piece of plywood that you're gonna stand on and like I said it's not necessary but I swear it feels so nice to stand on so luckily Frank has some of that too so uh, we're gonna put that under there as well to make it a really nice platform or garage you know <laughs> we got these really thick mats um, we're just gonna use these little pieces of wood to kind of level it out um, if we didn't it would have like a like a seven or eight millimeter difference which I mean it's not the end of the world but we might as well level it out now that we are at it so we're just gonna cut these up to make them fit and then we're gonna put those and then the last piece of plywood on top of that You guys, I have a platform. Look at this. We just need to put um, screws, so all the way around here, and then we're gonna put screws out here just to make sure it's all tight. Um, we didn't, so we just decided to leave this little piece of wood out here, um, just so we didn't have to cut it so we could just return it in the full pieces. Um, when the gym's open again and I won't be lifting anymore. So, but look at this, it's so cool. Actually, hang on, I'm just gonna do like a sexy slow-mo platform montage. That is it, you guys. I now have a platform and I'm so excited. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.